And here I'll end with uh, uh, a statement of one of our modern saints, uh, Paisios from Mount Athos, when someone asked him, what should we do? You know, should we follow strictly every word of the Tipicon and every word of the canon and have uh, olive oil in our lamps and never cut our hair and so and so? Or should we be all things to all people and try to be, you know, relevant and so on and lenient? And uh, this is from an eyewitness. The, this was from the person that Paisius said this to, who told me this, a priest from Czech Republic. Uh, he said, Paisius said, do either way, it's okay. He said, but, but, all elders always say, but. He said, but, it has to be for God's glory and the salvation of your brother. And if he says it's to the glory of God and for the salvation of your brother, then it will be orthodox. Then it will be true. Then it will be wise. He said, but if it's not for the glory of God and the salvation of your brother, it's just because you do what you want to do and you happen to like conservative and you happen to like liberal. He said, then the devil wins no matter what you're doing. And then he said, whatever you do, it can change. Different circumstances, different times. Sometimes you may be very lenient. You have a group of neophytes. Sometimes you have a monastery, you ought to be strict. If it says 40, Lord have mercy, say 40, Lord have mercy. You're not going anywhere, <laughs> you know. But if you're in a Vespers with 30 kids screaming and yelling, maybe you could do 12 or something, you know, or three, uh, you know. So you have to be wise. And, but he also said it can change. And then he also said, and whatever you do, it's got to not only be to God's glory and the good of the neighbor, according to the gospel, he said, but you got to do it without judging those who do differently. We're not here to judge each other. Even Jesus Christ himself said, I came not to judge the world, I came to save it. And so we have to be instruments of God saving the world and, and be faithful to the gospel, faithful to Christ, to God, the Holy Spirit, faithful to the Holy Fathers, but we worship God. We don't worship the fathers still. My professor used to say the Holy Fathers were not Holy Spirits, but they were our teachers and we have to follow them and obey them. And, and when we do, then God can inspire us to know what to do. Mm -hmm.